Hey, there's a, a great story in a book that I really want to share with you because it's something that I've struggled with. I continue to struggle with that, right? In the book, uh, The Art of Living, Bob Proctor, there's a story where I think he was in a, at a seminar or something, he was giving a presentation, right? And then throughout the day, he saw a guy like coming back and forth, like coming towards him and then going away, coming towards him and going away, right? And then eventually another guy comes and he's like the manager. He's like, oh, well, I want you to meet Bob. I forget the name. Um, he's been nervous about meeting you. And then Bob Proctor laughs and he's like, I'm sorry, I'm not laughing at you. I'm laughing at the idea. Because if, if I told you that I was nervous of meeting you, wouldn't you laugh? And the guy's like, yeah. And then he's like, well, then why would you be nervous about meeting me? Like, I think that's really fascinating because it's happened with me so many times. I've, I've gone to a ton of really, really, really good events where I was meeting people that I was like, holy crap, like I was really nervous. I was insanely nervous to actually go up and talk to them, right? A lot of events, have, I'm not gonna start naming people, but he, people that are huge on YouTube and other uh, social media channels. And I was very, very, very nervous to go up and say hi and talk to them, right? But it's kind of like that same idea, like if someone told you they were nervous about meeting you, you kind of laugh, like why? Why would you be nervous? Like, I'm a real person, I'm another human being just like you, right? I think what happens to me is that I put people in a pedestal and then I, I'm like, ah shit, like they're so high up there, so far away, so... Like, why would they want to talk to me, like that little guy who's uh, down there, right? And I definitely create that idea, that story in my mind, right? And definitely with women too, like, I'm like, oh, holy shit, like, she's so beautiful. She's not going to want to talk to me. And I either don't approach them or if I do, I'm all, like, insanely nervous and weird and awkward because I'm so... Uh, I'm pretty shy sometimes too, so it's like putting people in that pedestal. I've done it with friends too. Like in the road trip that I did throughout the country, I stayed with friends and I met friends and I, there's many friends that I feel so insanely grateful to have in my life and, and to be a part of their life and just share our, our journeys together and, and I put them so high up on a pedestal that I realized after the road trip, I was like, I wasn't even being myself. I was like, I don't know, trying to be cool, trying to be whatever so that <laughs> they would stay my friend, I guess. It's like, oh no, if you, if you really know who I am, then you wouldn't even be my friend, right? And I think it's funny, and that's something that I heard from an amazing coach once, like, when we try to be someone we're not, it's like, if you really knew who I am, then you wouldn't like me. And I think that's, there can be a lot of truth behind that, right? Maybe that's behind all of our fear of judgment and trying to be liked and trying to be accepted and trying to be, right? We pretend to be maybe a different way so that we're accepted because we think we're not going to be accepted the way we actually are. No filters, no mask, no nothing. So I know it's challenging. I know it's challenging to be that way, but I don't know, I find this idea fascinating and I thought the example that Bob gave was beautiful, I think it was perfect, right? Right? If, if I don't know, if the famous person tells you that he or she is nervous to meet you, you might laugh, you might be like, why? I'm just a regular person. So I think if we flip that, right, and you put yourself in that person's perspective and you just, I don't know, you flip the whole story around, you might realize like, okay, we're both, we're just two human beings, right? And I can be me, because who else am I gonna be? If they like me, great, if they, not, if they don't, I move forward, right? The journey keeps going on. And I don't know, I, it was just a cool idea. Uh, I'll definitely be sharing more ideas from the book. I'm gonna put a link below if you wanna check out the book. I think Bob has a lot of very, very interesting ideas. He's a very uh, smart guy, very wise man. So, um, so yeah, check it out below. I'll put the link, see what you think. 
Uh, let me know what you think about the video. Give it a thumbs up if you liked it. And uh, that's it. Definitely a lot more coming. So stay tuned. Subscribe if you want to or don't subscribe if you don't. Have a beautiful day.